What's going on, YouTube? So, finally got over all the quarantine BS. I finally am allowed to go fish all the lakes. They almost shut it completely down. You had to be a resident, and naturally, I live a long ways away from any good lakes, so it kind of sucked. I haven't posted in a while, so if you guys forgive me for that. Now that I'm monetized, a lot more coming at you, but I hope you enjoy this video of a catch and cook catfish tacos on the beach. It is a, it, it's a fun way to, it's just awesome to go out on the, on the beach and cook them as you catch them, and it's just delicious fresh fish that you caught yourself. It's just a lot of benefits to that. But as always, enjoy the video. We'll see you next time. I'll be out fishing. I'm gonna doing a 10 day fishing spree. So should be coming out with lots of cool videos. So make sure you stay tuned for that and subscribe and hit that notification button so you can know when I post. I'm gonna try posting two or three times a week, but we'll see what happens. Enjoy the video. Let's get some casting going. Hey guys, got catfish on the bobber. See if we can get him hooked. Kind of big bait. I kind of let him eat it for a minute. Up, up. Oh, I think I got him. No, no, missed him. Dang it. Alright, guys. Got another fish on, hopefully. Come on, take it. I think I got him. Oh, I got him. <laughs> yeah. We got him, boys. We got him. Ooh, good one. I right, see what this is. That's yeah, a pretty good cat. Pretty good one. Pretty good cat right here, fellas. Okay. Been sitting there playing with the bait forever. He finally decided to eat it. Ooh, back here, bud. Good cat. Cool colors. Ah. No, nope, don't go in the boat, bud. Come here. Come here. Oh, he's a fighter. We got a fighter. Ah, yeah. That's a big cat, guys. Dang good cat. Wow. Look at that fatty. Dang good fatty. Woohoo! Nice cat. Beautiful catfish. <laughs> awesome. Beautiful catfish. Beautiful. Kind of like. Yeah. Pretty sweet. That's awesome. Good cat. Look at that. That's a good one. Oh. Hold on. I don't know what's going on here. Can't believe how hard he was pulling. He was pulling that thing hard and he didn't have it in his mouth. That's crazy. Take it. Got him. Got him. Oh yeah. Got him. Alright, come on boy. Keep some pressure on him. Come on. Come on. Here we go guys. Okay guys, nice spawner right there, 
Pretty sweet. Cool fish. Just in the pre-spawn right now. So the bite should really turn on here in the next couple weeks, but they're biting, so we'll see what happens. Whoa! Take it. Eat it. Eat it. Okay, got him guys. Oh yeah, good one. This is a good one. Oh wow. This is a big one guys. Big one. Real big one. I think I might be wrapped I think I might be wrapped around some bushes too. Ah, wrapped around something. Ah. Ah, come on. Ah, there we go. We're free. Oh, he's swimming right to me. Ah, good job, bud. Keep right coming right to me. Oh yeah. Ah. That's a pretty good one. Not bad. Not bad at all. I got him, I think. Oh. Alright, guys, finally. Guy went through a dry spill there for a minute. Oh. 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 It's a good cat right there, guys. Dang good cat. Okay guys, we're out here. We're gonna cook up them catfish right now. Fish tacos out on the beach. And it is a beautiful, beautiful day. No, no bugs, I mean it is awesome. So let's get to cooking guys. Big old meaty catfish right here. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna try something new that I've never done before. I'm gonna cut the tail off and bleed it out because I heard that's a good way to do it. So I'm gonna try it, I've never done it this way before. So we are going to cut the tail off like that and then we're going to hang it up and let it bleed out. See all that blood? We're going to let it bleed out. So we're going to go hang it in a tree and then we'll continue. So just going to tie it on this tree right here. We're roughing it. So we're just going to let that sit there and let, it, let all that blood drain out. And while it's draining we're going to build a fire. So. Yeah, kind of worked out good. Just found some wire. I didn't bring any wire. I found some. Someone burned a tire next to the lake, like a bunch of a holes. But anyway, we're gonna use that. To hang the catfish. Okay, so I got this fire starter on Amazon. So we're gonna see if I can light a fire the old school way. It's just old flint and steel. So here we go. Got flames. Hopefully, we can keep them here. Just some little twigs. Got it, guys. Old Flint and Steel on Amazon, like eight bucks. <laughs> Split out pretty good. We're running out of daylight, so we gotta hurry now. So probably didn't bleed out as much, but it had a lot of blood come out of it. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, 
we're just gonna carve it. Really thick catfish. Just barely cut that skin. Try to do this without pliers. Usually it's nice to have grippers, but I forgot them, so I'm gonna see if I can do this by hand here. It's gonna be kind of rough. Ah, oh, there we go. I think we'll be able to get these tongs. All right, there we go, guys. <laughs> oh man, always bring a pair of pliers with you. <laughs> oh, that was rough. Okay, I'm just gonna. Cut that meat off of there. Yeah, beautiful white meat. I think that helped quite a bit. Really white. Nice fillet there, cool. Okay, another nice fillet right there. Time for some seasoning. Heck yeah. All right, so first, I'm gonna do some cayenne pepper. I love some cayenne pepper. And then some blacks, some black pepper. Nice and seasoned. And then some salt. I like kosher salt, but any salt work. I just prefer kosher salt. Okay, time to go on the fire. That's gonna be delicious. Mm -mm -mm. Olive oil in. Fire's nice and hot. There's a couple testers. I like those little pieces like that. I can test it out. Oh, yeah. The blades are so big, can't even stick them on the fire. I'm not even mad about it. Okay, I'm gonna let that cook. It's gonna be good. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna flip these real fast. Oh yeah. Mm -mm -mm. That's perfect. So now, next, I'm just gonna add a little bit of butter. I don't want dry fish. Get it all juicy. The smell is incredible, guys. This is just way good. Wow. Incredible. Mm mm mm. Nice and juicy. So, yeah, guys, just keep it on the pan. Flip them over. Those beautiful charcoal lines right there. Makes dang good flavor. So now what we're gonna do, it's a little hot, but we're just gonna make a little taco, just like that. Kind of keep it that way and let it cool off. Forms a nice little taco, street tacos, baby. That's my number one word is baby. If I say it a lot, just don't even let me know about it. I know I say it a lot, so just like saying baby. Oh, I forgot a little cup. We're gonna make a little bit of sauce, so I'm just gonna use a tortilla for a cup. It's gonna be kind of kind of crazy, but we can make it happen here. So all you need 
is just some deli mustard and some Miracle Whip. Need a lot, just a little bit. If you want too much, we'll put that on. So, I guess I'm just gonna mix it up on this tortilla. <laughs> oh, roughing it, guys. We are roughing it, but it's all right. We're gonna make it work. Okay. So then, let's line up our tacos here. So then, just get a little bit. Doesn't take a lot. Line the bottom just like that. You don't want too much, but you don't you want enough. So there's some right there. Perfect. Just like that. Let's do this one. This looks good. Line that taco up. It's nice about these big catfish fillets, man. You can feed a lot of people. Okay. Need some cheese. Real simple, not a lot. I didn't want to bring too much out here because it's always a pain. I always forget stuff. Doesn't matter how long I think about it, I'll always forget something. Especially when you've been out fishing all day. You never know what you're gonna forget. <laughs> and then, taco sauce. Oh yeah, beautiful. Here we go, catfish taco. Pretty simple. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. You got, you got to come try a catfish taco. Come, when you guys catch catfish, cook it this way. Let me know in the comments. Catfish street tacos right here. Can't beat, look at how beautiful this view is. The smell of the smoke, cooking, I mean, you can't beat it. You can't beat coming out here and cooking outdoors. You just can't beat it. Filthy hands, filthy mouth. But we're having a good time. Anyway, hope you guys like this video. Hit that, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.